welcome back to my channel. I feel like I have not recorded a video in forever, but today's video is going to be a skincare video and I figured this will be perfect because I just got home from an intense workout and I sweated so much and it was so disgusting. So um, I figured it would be a perfect time for me to show you my skincare routine for after you work out because my routine in the morning is different from like when I work out, you know, because I just have all this sweat build up and I just wanna get all the yucky stuff out of my face, out my pores and just, you know, start fresh to maintain clear, nice skin. So I'm gonna show you my favorite products I like to use um, for post-workout and to get my face nice and clean. So stay tuned. Okay, so here's my face and um, when I work out, I do do my eyebrows and I put like a tinted moisturizer on and I feel like my face looks kind of yellow or orange on camera right now, but it's really not. Um, so I just don't want to look half dead at the gym. So I try to like make myself look awake. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get the makeup off my eyebrows and like the little mascara I have on. So I just use this makeup remover, um, oil free makeup remover and I use this micellar water to get all of it off. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Okay, so now that all that's taken off, I'm going to use my Shea Moisture Black African bamboo I believe charcoal face wash this is one of my favorite face washes to use um, it just gets everything out and I have oily skin so it has charcoal on it which helps with the oil so I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face a washed face so what I'm going to use now is a facial scrub which I love because it exfoliates your face and it leaves it feeling amazing so um, this is the tea me right here the tea me green tea facial scrub and I have been using it for a while so it hydrates exfoliates and moisturizes um, and I just love it um, and the first ingredient in it is sugar cane which is great because that's like a natural organic um, ingredient and yeah it just it smells amazing I love all things that are green so here's what it looks like nice and green so um, you're supposed to dampen your face before you use it so I'm going to put a little bit of water on my face real quick because you don't want to use um a sugar, a sugar scrub a facial scrub on your face on like super dry skin because that's just not a good idea so i'm just going to take a little bit this was like a lot of it but i'm going to try to use my whole um use this to cover up my whole face and just put it on my skin oh i love the way it smells and feels so i just like to put it on first and this is perfect, especially, ah! <laughs> it's perfect, especially if you are like on the go type person and you don't have like time to do a whole, you know, skincare face routine at night. So you put it on and you like, to, you like to, you should rub it in, well I like to. I like to rub it in a circular motion around my face, especially around my um nose and like my forehead up here and my eyebrows those are like the most problem areas i have and i mean they're not really a problem it's just that i get so oily over there and i want to make sure like my pores don't have all that build up in it so and is it me or do y'all get oily like above your eyebrows because my face will get oily a little bit here but like the most oily it gets is above my eyebrows which just started happening like a few within the last couple of years 
but it was so it's so weird like i don't know so anyway we're gonna scrub a dub dub around i like to do it for like a minute or so before i wash it off and it feels so good you guys like it feels amazing it's therapeutic there was one time i just sat there and just kept rubbing it in my face forever and the best part about it is that you can use it two to four times a week and it does not like strip your face, dry it out, or any of that. Because I know a lot of scrubs that I used before, you can't use it that many times. So this one's gentle. Um, when I take it off, my face might be a little red. That's just because every time I use a scrub on my face, it turns out to be a little red. Just because of it's being exfoliated and everything. But yeah. Alright, so I'm done with the green stuff on my face. So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it off my face now. All right, so I'm back and I washed the facial scrub off my face. Um, so next I'm going to moisturize my skin with one of my other favorites by Ole Hankerson. And this is a moisturizer and it's a gel moisturizer, a vitamin C moisturizer at that. Um, so this is what it looks like inside. Yes. So I'm just going to take a little bit and as you guys can see, my face does look a little red and it's okay. My face does not hurt. It's just every time I exfoliate my face, I guess because of the color of my skin, that's on the lighter side, you know, it just turns red for like a couple minutes and it goes back to normal. But it doesn't like hurt or anything. My face feels very, very smooth. So I'm gonna rub this in. All right. And then now for the last thing that I love to use, which is like one of my top favorites is the Timmy Vit Vit C Vitamin C Serum. Um, I love serums. I have been using serums forever. Like I don't know since probably since I graduated from college, I've been using serums. My mom used to use serums on her face before she goes to bed, and she looks amazing at her age. So I just figured, you know, let me start early. So this serum has vitamin C, of course, and it has um, hibiscus in it. And I try to get products that have vitamin C because it helps brighten your face and gives it a glow. So like a lot of stuff that I have has vitamin C. That's like one of the first things I look at when I get a product, does it have vitamin C in it? So I'm just gonna take this serum right here and apply like, I already put like half of one, but three drops, oh gosh on my finger and I'm just going to apply it to my whole face and what I like about this serum is that it smells good and it doesn't leave your face like feeling extra oily or anything like I haven't tried it under makeup yet but I feel like if I wanted to I could wear it under my makeup because when it like dries and it absorbs into your skin, it leaves like a nice like matte, not all the way mattifying, but it leaves a nice glow, but you're not like oily or shiny after it. So yeah, so this is what it looks like after I rubbed it all in. All right, so that was my post-workout face skincare routine. Um, if you guys are interested in the Teamy products, I will leave them listed below. And I have a coupon for 20% off. It's NT20. So you can get 20% off. If, if you have not, tongue twister, if you have not watched my previous skincare video, which is when I do my mask and my Sunday routine, I use the Teamy 
um, detox mask in that too and I love it so like all their products I absolutely love I have been using them for a while and I need to re-up soon but they're all amazing and they're like really really good for your skin and I had zero issues and I have very sensitive skin so I have to be careful what I use on my face um, I have atopic dermatitis so like certain facial products or makeup cause these dry patches um, and cause a lot of redness on my face but I try these products and they don't do any of that which I love which is amazing so make sure you guys check out my previous skincare video and I'll leave the link to this video not this video these products below all the products that I use and thank you so much Timmy for sponsoring this skincare routine video I'll make sure I leave all the links below to all the products I use and I'll see you next time bye you guys